There's a Wulu! Okay! There's a Mega Stone right there! I can't get it though. Pokemon Trainer Brendan, he's got a core fish. He kicks it off with a Geodude. It's level 12. But that's an Alolan Geodude. Butterfree, go! Yo! What is going on YouTube? It's your boy Dan, aka Drive. Pretty guys, a brand new series today, and we are gonna be playing through Pokemon Radical. Red. You might be thinking to yourself, what is going on with Radical Red? What even is that? Radical Red is apparently one of the hardest, if not the hardest, Pokemon fan-made games of all time. It is meant to be very, very difficult. It is meant to be incredibly difficult. And uh, we're gonna be jumping into it today for this amazing Let's Play. So if you guys see this on YouTube, this is gonna be a, uh, a stream Let's Play that's gonna go up on YouTube as well. Uh, so if you guys enjoy, be sure to like the video. I want to see you guys show some love. And if you want to tune into the live streams, you can go to twitch.tv slash adrive to watch. But let me explain some stuff about Radical Red here. They talk about this right now. The thing about Radical Red is it has Mega Evolutions. It has Raid Dens. Gigantamaxes are made into Megas, if I'm not mistaken. You can Shiny Hunt with Dex Nav. The game is super duper competitive. I mean, it's going to be nuts, dude. It's going to be nuts. So nuts that I was told that I could not actually Nuzlocke it or do a type only playthrough, I needed to just play it vanilla. And I have not done a vanilla Let's Play in years, dude. Like I haven't just done a non Nuzlocke in years, but we're gonna try it out and see exactly how hard it actually is. Professor Oak, hello there, glad to meet you. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. I mean, we know all this. Chad, who's my rival? We're gonna name him Marvin. Let's see what we got here. I got a potion, it's a good start. That is a good start for us. I do not wanna set the randomizer option. No, I do not want it to be a randomizer. I want to play it the way the creator intended it. Now a reminder, this is not an Uzlock, but I will keep track of the Pokemon that faint with the little skull, all right? And I want to consider myself, uh, I, I want to say that I, before we get any further, I want to say that I consider myself to be a pretty good Nuzlocker and pretty good Let's Player. So let's see how hard this really is. And so it's the standard starters, Bulbasaur, Squirrel, and, and, uh, and uh, Charmander. I think, yeah, I'm taking Charmander, baby! I'm gonna take Zippo. We're gonna take Zippo this time. I don't know, if, I mean, that's gonna make it harder, but uh, we'll see what happens. I'm a big I'm a big Zippo fan. He has an item already. He's Hasty Nature with an Orin Berry, and he has C, E minus, E, E, A plus speed. So he's got flawless speed, really bad stats otherwise, and scratch and growl. I love the interface. It's like uh, Black and White's interface, I think. Easy, dude! Easiest game ever! They said this game was hard! They said it was- I just beat a water type with a fire type! They said this game was hard. I love that I can run right away, too. It's- it's a very wonderful thing. Route to one! I have no Pokeballs. That's a buddy! Right out the gates! So as you can very clearly see, there are some different- Oh, and it just flashed its type on the side, too, I think. It shows its type on the sides. That's really cool. But look, when you it shows your types when you go to choose a move. That's really cool. All right, we made it to Viridian, so that's a good start. Uh, we're gonna go get Pokeballs. I, I don't want to do too much until I can actually catch stuff. How's my old Pokemon? Oh, yes, sir. I do indeed have the Oaks Parcel. There you go. Okay, here's some tools for catching wild Pokemon. And now we have Pokeballs. So now I can catch stuff for our team, which is good. You want to give me a map? So now we have Pokeballs, and we can catch things, and we can just, you know, battle things. There's a Rattata. I'm just gonna beat some stuff up real quick, and then if we find anything cool, I'll catch it. We learned Ember, which is massive. And let us go heal. So they can change your nature for 7,500, which is kind of dope. So that's a new feature in the game, where you can change the nature of your Pokemon for 7,500 Poke Dollars. Uh, let's see what's on 22 before I go any further. I am definitely not gonna battle my rival yet. There's a Wooloo! Okay! Little Wooloo action. I like it. It's like a Wooloo party. Oh, a Starly. Ooh, wait a minute. Starly's cool, though. Yeah, I'll catch a Starly. Mohawk joins the team. Yeah, I'll take, I'll take a Starly. That's a cool mod. I like this guy. We got Mohawk. All right, let's see what else is here. Mankey. Now, that's probably worth capturing. Just, oh, I gotta update my team, yeah. Dude, look at that, precision. All right, we're gonna name him Prime. Cause you already know about them Prime Apes. Dino with another gifted sub, it's gonna be, oh no, I did not mean to go and battle him. I'm about to get wrecked. That's, <laughs> well, we're gonna have our 
our first knockouts. Level, wait a minute, you know what? Maybe, I don't know, let's find out, let's find out. I'm not gonna, not gonna call it done yet. I didn't really think about that. A nice crit, yo, I like that animation for crit, that looked cool. And here comes Squirtle. All right, uh, I think the, what is my team looking like right now? They're weakened, right? Oh God. Yeah, we're done for. He's got water, go oh yeah, we lost. We lost, that's one faint, we lost. I'm gonna put three deaths. I legitimately wasn't even trying to go up there. I was just training and for some reason my can A young goose! My controller shot up there. It did it again! Stop doing that! I legitimately was not trying to battle him both times, dude. This is this is very, very dumb. <laughs> Bro, get out of here. I, I feel like it's so stupid that I have six deaths right now, because there's no way in any world that I would have actually battled him. Zippo, let's do it! The other two attempts didn't actually count because it was an accident, alright? He always does, he always does, but he's burned, so it doesn't do as much. One down. He's gonna tail whip again. All right. I mean, listen, if you wanna tail whip me, that is fine with me. Zippo went down, but it's okay. It's all part of the strategy. Prime, this is your battle, baby. There we go. We did it. Okay, so, <laughs> again, I, I lost seven lives. It should have only been one, but it, it's whatever, dude. Prize for that. All right, I don't know if there's anything over here extra. It might just be the same stuff, I think so. <gasps> there's a mega stone right there! I can't get it though. That's a mega stone. Um, let's go do this, I guess. I don't know if there's any point in talking to anybody here. Oh, well, she just gave me the wise glasses. Wait a minute, then I guess so. I just answered my own question. That's it. Okay, well, I learned my lesson. We gotta talk to everybody. Oh, you must be a drive. I almost didn't recognize you. I'm one of Oak's aides. I was picking up some packages for the professor. I think he wanted to give you this, but didn't manage to give it to you on time. The Dex Nav! I may give you these too. Here's some orange berries. Take care. You already know what that means. Ooh, a Shinx is chilling here? Yo, what is this encounter table? And Hopip? All right, um, let's give Mohawk some action. Just at least until he learn. Well, I'm probably better off. How do I just access that Dex Nav menu? Hold up. Oh, I see. Okay, that's cool. It's like, okay. It shows its search level. Tackle Intimidate. So I, I, I get more info the more I do it. Dude, we need a shiny bug, do we not? All right, let's, 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 I don't know. I mean, we could try it, right? Let's go find some bug types and see what's available in Viridian and see what we can do here. Cause that's kind of cool, actually. Let's see what we got here. Oh, it is different. A comb. A combi. A scatter bug? Oh. Okay. Well, we know what we're going for. We already know what we're going for. I mean, is is it is it even a question at this point? We might we might actually shiny hunt this. I don't know. I don't know if I have it in me. All right. Well, I'm gonna name it Overdrive for now, and if I find another one that's shiny, then we'll be good to go. Mohawk's evolving already, baby. Mohawk carrying already. Yeah, baby! All right, good stuff, Mohawk. So, oh, and then, Bro, I feel like Shedinja's kinda dope, hold up. Nice. I don't know, I don't necessarily know if he's gonna be on my team. I'm just gonna catch a, a, a bunch of stuff. This one has compound eyes, I think. All right, so we caught a little Joltik. I don't know. Oh, you can see if you can counter everything. Oh, I'm missing some. Oh, that's a cool little thing there. I didn't even think about that. It's jolly nature. It's pretty bad. Does have compound eyes though. Great special attack. Otherwise, pretty bad. It has absorb, which is kind of cool. So maybe we can use that. I don't know. So I, I, I feel like it's actually not terrible. Not saying I'm going to do it right now. I'm thinking I'm going to probably go through the rest of the forest first. I should probably make sure my team is actually good against, against Brock, but... Let's um, let's grab a potion here. I'm not convinced that these guys are gonna be on the team yet, guys. So don't don't badger me about the layout yet, okay? All right, bug catcher Rick. He's got a caterpie. What level are we talking here? Level four. I mean, that's that's nothing. That's nothing. You know, that's not even like, not even a thing. All right, so we got some rock smashing areas here. I don't have any rock smashing Pokemon. Well, I mean, the forest was was nothing yet. Oh. There should be a Joltik here somewhere. Hello, I'm just trying to catch some Pokemon before I face Brock. You're gonna challenge him as well. Why don't we have a battle then? All right, well, let's see what you got. Is this Brendan? Pokemon trainer Brendan, he's got a core fish. 
Level, oh dude, but I'm so high of a level right now. I'm at the level cap because I was grinding for the, the grubbin, so he's gonna have Trico. <laughs> I mean, it's whatever. Like, no big deal. He's gonna give me an experience share. Oh, now, now we're cruising, dude. Stat scanner. You can analyze the EVs and IVs of a Pokemon in your party. That's, that's some cool stuff right there. Hold up. The experience share I can use. Oh, I'm gonna, no, I'm gonna leave it on. And then the stat scanner, let's scan Mohawk. 37 attack. So you can kind of, you can see their EVs and IVs and stuff. He's got a lot of attack. It's because of all these grubbins I'm knocking out, right? There's another Mega Stone, I want it! I'm so jealous. All right, well, I'm pure, we're in pewter. There's two Mega Stones chilling, dude. All right, what are you doing outside? Shouldn't you be in, I did not go. That's the museum, thanks, dude. <laughs> Where's the slowpoke lady? Slacking. I'd supposed to be paid to get in, but they just let me in. Running a space exhibit. You want a Pikachu? Well, we can't always get what we want, kid. I'm Faulkner, a gym leader from Johto. I'm traveling in Kanto looking for information on Mega Evolution, but I've found nothing so far. A battle is what you're looking for. I guess I could spare the time. I'll demonstrate the power of elegant bird Pokemon. Facing off against Faulkner. He's got a Fetchling, level nine. That's all, right? That's all? I'm wasting so much experience right now by not getting into other Pokemon, though. You think he's got Pidgeotto or Pidgey? Oh, well, I guess it's not that bad, then, now that we have experience here. Corvusquat! Okay. I mean, listen. He's got a Corvusquire. Genji to seven. All right. Yeah, you better learn something about the Mega Stones. He's gonna give me Roost, okay. Thanks for Roost, I'll take it. So we know we can't use potions in battle, so that's not bad. So we got to battle Faulkner in the museum, that was kind of cool. I already like the little little tweaks so far that we've seen. I'm a trainer, you have an egg. Oh, I need five grand for the egg. That guy looks like he's gonna get, it's a dragon egg. That looks like Drayden, dude. All right, so I can't go that way. So, I mean, we're, we're really, I mean, we're at the point now where we, we gotta face Brock, right? So there's a Pan Sage, that's, an, that's actually, it's actually like, I mean, I'm not a big Pan Sage guy, but I think that's a that's a worthwhile pickup. That's why I knocked it out. Um, oh yeah, but you know what? I can I can deck snap it, right? So let's let's deck snap him. You need to stand a pokeball by chuckle. Let's get it. And I'm gonna name him Emerald. Or Emmy, actually. We'll name her Emmy. I mean, I definitely do not have an optimal team for him. Let's see what I, well, I gotta, I'm gonna take on his little trainers first. I got Emmy first. Yo, champ of the making, this is your first gym, so I gotta inform you. Accuracy reducing moves have been, evasion raising effects have been removed from this game. Baton pass is removed from this game. Sleep claws is in effect, meaning only one Pokemon per team can be asleep. Oko moves are removed from this game. The bag is inaccessible during trainer battles. There's a level cap, which reduces experience gain significantly, which is 15 right now. Pokemon disobey when they get too far above the cap. Consumable held items come back after trainer battles. Battle style is forced to set. You cannot thief items to the trainer. If you ever want me to read, it, read the rules, let me know. That's wild, dude. Okay, so I do have some berries. So let's let's go to our berry bag. Let's let's battle these couple bat this this one trainer and see how hard he is, and then we'll decide how we're how we're gonna if we're gonna take on Brock yet, or if I want to do a little bit more grinding, or what's gonna happen. So let's see. We got Camper Liam, he's got a Roly Coley to kick it off. Okay. Is he fire type at that? I don't know, I'm just gonna go to Prime right away. Emmy gets the 12, love to see it. Prime gets a little bit of love. And here comes a Drillbur, okay. Let's see what happens. We're level 15 now, so that's good. So he's max level. I mean, let's, uh, dude, let's just drop a potion, see what happens, right? If I get wrecked, I get wrecked. I'm light years away from facing Bro. I mean, listen, our team is not exactly that good right now. Is a careful nature. I mean, look at that. He's, he's stat S. Is S flawless? It's gotta be, right? But uh, I mean, this is the team, so I, I think I think we could give it a shot. Let's see. I mean, we're not gonna pretend like I'm gonna have an easy time here. So you're here. I'm Brock. I'm Pewter's gym leader. My rock hard willpower is evident even in my Pokemon. My Pokemon are rock hard and have true grit determination. That's right. My Pokemon are the rock type. You're gonna challenge me knowing that you're lose. That's the trainer's honor that compels you to challenge me. Fine, show me your best. Let's see what you got, Brock. I mean, I'm, I'm interested. He's got three Pokemon. 
He kicks it off with a Geodude. It's level 12. But that's an Alolan Geodude. That's an Alolan Geodude. So he does not have six Pokemon. I thought he was gonna have six. He does not have six. I got a nice uh, Vine Whip. He's gonna Rock Tune. That's gonna tickle. Yeah. All right, so that was not the start I wanted. Um, uh, here comes our Berry. I'm not sure that's gonna help much, but I don't think that's gonna give us a situation to live. I'm gonna Vine Whip. Maybe I'm faster. Nah, no, we're gonna. He's gonna knock us out. Obviously, Mankey is like a really big key to our success here, right? So that's a faint, but that's okay. I kind of want to go Charlotte and absorb here. I think he's low enough. Maybe not. I don't know. I'm gonna do it anyway. He's gonna switch out and go into Volpix. Excuse me? You can do that? Brock, I don't know if you realize that's that's not a rock type, Brock. That's that's not a Yeah, take that prediction! Nah, he's gonna confuse Ray. This is anime Brock, dude. Anime Brock. I wonder what he's gonna go for. I kinda wanna go to Mohawk right now, because Mohawk's pretty useless otherwise. Although, Intimidate, it could be really worthwhile. I respect it, I respect it. I mean, I kinda have to go overdrive and just kinda sack it. Spark! Take that, let me take that. Oh, okay, he gets the lucky para though. Can we just talk about that? He got a lucky para against me. I mean, you could, you could say what you want. <laughs> Don't worry though, I've got Prime and Prime is gonna beat this Geodude. Okay, so Geodude's gone. Can't really get any XP out of that, but that's okay. Vulpix is weakened. So like, I mean, I have a very good Vulpix response here in Zippo, right? I think I just scratch, right? Like, get a nice little 10%, 20, oh, that was good damage. It's gonna confuse Ray. It's kind of annoying. It's gonna switch out, predicting the scratch, and go into Onyx, level 14 Onyx. Let's see what happens. I hit myself a confusion, okay. I think I'm gonna go Charlotte here and just sack it off. I wanna keep Zippo, cause Zippo beats Vulpix later, right? So let's go Charlotte. Here comes the Bulldoz? That's honestly okay. All right. Now we're gonna low kick with Mankey. Is one million percent the play here. We got Prime. He's faster than me! Oh, wait a minute, hold on! Oh, he lived because of Sturdy? And he's got a berry. Wow. I'm going big boy strats right now. Easy, eat it up. Give me that berry, I'm nom nom. Chomp chomp. We're good, bro, we're good. I, I, he, he needs like a super crit to beat me now, I think at this point. I think we're gonna be all right. Onyx goes down and his last is the Vulpix here. Mohawk did its thing. I mean, we had to make a bold switch, predicting the Bulldoze, swapping out Mankey. My logic was if I get the Intimidate off, then I know that I can beat the Onyx because I could live the next attack and then, you know, beat him from there. You know, if this was a Nuzlocke, I could see that being pretty hard. I'm not gonna lie, right? I think if I had six Pokemon at level 15, but I didn't get to choose the Pokemon, I could see how that would be very difficult to Nuzlocke, I'm not gonna lie. We'll take it. And we're gonna get Rock Tomb as our TM. All right, why don't I go try to grab, uh, let's try the Grubbin again, I guess, for a little bit. Oh, we got Zippo evolving, baby. That's not bad, not bad at all. There is Charmillion. How's this egg doing? I kind of want to hatch the egg too. Let's do that real quick. I think I could probably hatch it super fast, right? If I just run around like crazy. So that's gonna be the end of this episode of Pokemon Radical Red. Trying something a little different. Obviously we were able to take on Brock, but this game is apparently gonna get a lot harder according to many, many people. So if you guys wanna try Radical Red yourself, I'll have it in the description below. And if you guys enjoyed this episode, be sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel if you guys are new, and keep an eye out on my Twitch live streams. We're gonna be doing Radical Red. But I'm gonna do it like I just did, right? Like we, we did a whole gym in one episode. So we're gonna really keep those highlights going and we're gonna have some fun with that. So thank you guys for watching this episode and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace. If you guys enjoyed this video, you should definitely check out this one right here. Otherwise, this one's pretty awesome too. Check out one of my videos, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.